A cloudy start to your Thursday for the southern areas of South Africa with a mix of high and mid-level cloud. We're also expecting foggy patches the morning over the inch of the eastern Cape, parts of Kuzulu Natal, Mpumalanga, as well as Limpopo. Mostly cloudy skies at first over the extreme northern areas of South Africa. Otherwise, it's going to be a much warmer day for the central and northeastern areas. Lots of cloud also expected to spread over the eastern Cape and some light rain possible in parts of Kuzulu Natal. With isolated storms later moving down from our neighboring country, countries over the northern areas of South Africa. We're still expecting this northeasterly to easterly wind to blow moderate to fresh along the southern coastline on Thursday with light winds over the interior of the country. A few isolated storms likely to bubble up here over parts of KwaZulu Natal as well as Lesotho and the Eastern Cape. Only a 10% chance of drizzle along the eastern escarpment mainly early in the morning and then yet again into the evening. Light rain possible over the northern coast of KwaZulu Natal with isolated storms expected to move down from our neighboring country Namibia and Botswana over the northern areas of the Northern Cape and Western and Northwest. But here in the Western Cape, it's going to be another uncomfortably hot day in Ferndal and Clan William. Temperatures just a few degrees below 40 degrees the afternoon. Also hot over the coast with 33 in Langabon and 32 in Cape Town. Lots of cloud moving over the Western Cape, so it's going to feel a little bit more humid than usual with an easterly wind blowing along the southern coastline. Temperatures over there remaining in the lower 20s but heating up in Beaufort West with a high of 31 as well as in Hrafrenet. Still expecting an east to easterly, northeasterly wind along the coast of the Eastern Cape on Thursday. Lots of cloud moving over the province where we're expecting temperatures in the mid to upper 20s and isolated storms are likely in the vicinity of Batatiel or Kua. Most of the storms expected to bubble up here over Lister to the southern Jorgensburg and near Kokstad. And then foggy patches experts at first in parts of Kuzuri Natal, otherwise a partly cloudy day with maximum temperatures reaching in the mid-20s. In Pumalanga, we're expecting foggy patches the morning with partly cloudy skies, but a warmer afternoon for the province with maximum temperatures above 20 degrees over the high felt. Also some cloud the morning hanging around in Limpopo with foggy patches along the escarpment and drizzle possible in Toyando as well as Zanin. It's a hot afternoon for the bush farm. Much warmer conditions for northwest on a Thursday with maximum temperatures now reaching the upper 20s, 30 degrees over the western areas where we're also expecting isolated storms from from late afternoon into the evening. In the Northern Cape, lots of cloud moving over parts of the Karoo, but warming up into the afternoon, temperatures around 30 degrees and isolated storms expected to move down from Namibia over parts of the Kalahari as well as over Portsmouthburg. In the Free State, it's a mainly sunny to partly cloudy Thursday with maximum temperatures now in the mid to upper 20s. And a much warmer and comfortable spring day ahead for halting, mainly sunny skies 24 in Johannesburg and 25 in Pretoria. On Friday, that band of thunderstorms stretching over the central part of South Africa, expected to develop over the northern Cape, moving in an eastwards direction over northwest the Free State and large parts of the eastern Cape. It's going to be cloudy and much cooler in the mother city. And then overnight into Saturday, thunderstorms are spreading eastwards over the rest of northwest the Free State, eastern Cape, later reaching Kuzuli Natal, and a few isolated storms likely to bubble up over parts of Halte. Well, that's all from me. And remember, no matter the weather, we're in this together.